This is supposed to be a place of reverence and reflection, but most of the woodland cemetery is covered with heavy brush, weeds, and overgrown trees. Over 80,000 souls are buried here. Wow. Unrecognizable. Concerned family members must work hard to find the final resting place of their ancestors. 1940 here. Sorry, I was off by four years. It took the department Helen store Coker. Here never married. And she worked at the department store here and never married. Philip Cother has 18 family members buried on this plot, including his great great grandmother. We're standing. There's the stone. So the stone's right there. So four lots, double and triple deep. This was once mostly a German cemetery filled with dazzling obelisks, now near sunken graves. The people buried here helped Edison and Tesla lead us into the innovations of the early 20th century. The grave markers date back before the Civil War. Soldiers from that internal conflict are buried here, along with those from Vietnam. Yeah. This is a place steeped in history. Okay, and this is our, our family plot marker. This was the first headstone I found when I came here. Warren Vincent's personally cleared his family plot where over a dozen relatives are buried. He led the effort to restore 45% of the 36-acre site. Still, they battle illegal dumping and general disregard, but he volunteers as a labor of love. A family pride, uh, a professional pride, and I know I'm reaching out and helping. While many tombstones are toppled and buried, the cemetery has resumed selling plots to raise money. Even while the Gothic Victorian gatehouse is a neighborhood eyesore in desperate need of repair. Some of the floors have collapsed. The stairway to the second floor is collapsed, but it's the exterior shell is stable. The neighborhood welcomes any efforts to renovate the cemetery, which has been used by criminals to dump stolen cars and where murder has taken place. Normally people are scared of the graveyard, but there's not the, the people that have passed away, it's the, the people that's alive that you gotta worry about. According to the New Jersey Cemetery Association, there are over 100 graveyards in similar condition or worse, but none of them have the same prominence or history as Woodland Cemetery.